pathetic, a disgrace. I, I don't even. I, that don't even deserve to be recorded in the stew. That don't even. That don't even deserve to be recorded in the stew. It was. It, is it? Are we serious? Are we a serious ball club? At times, you 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 got a question. Listen, the Philadelphia Eagles was almost. I, I think it still counts as a blowout. They basically they got their back beat out. The Eagles got their back beat out by a score of 33-16 by the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. A score of 33-16 by the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I'm going to just give y'all a brief rundown of how the emotional roller coaster took me this evening. First of all, the Bucs went up the field and did whatever they wanted on the first drive. Then they did it again on the second drive. But well, we went three and out. You know what I mean? We went three and out. They did it again on the second drive. We stop them at 14 zip. Self-inflicted wound number one. You know what I'm saying? Running into the damn kicker. Running into the damn kicker. You, you, you know, man, it's just laughable, man. For real, for real, man. At one point, I was ready to cut the game off, man. I was ready to cut the game off at about 20, 21 zip. I was ready to cut the game off, man, because... The defense just looked pathetic, man. No pass rush. Can't tackle. I think we missed about 13 tackles in this game. Guys are diving at the ankles of Baker Mayfield on a goal line on a fourth and one. Diving at the ankles of Baker Mayfield. Instead of lighting his ass up. Diving at the ankles of Baker Mayfield. The lack of effort was laughable. The lack of effort was laughable. Disgrace. A disgrace. A disgrace. I'm embarrassed by what I saw from that defense. That's first and foremost. I'm embarrassed by the lack of adjustment by Vic Fangio. Are we really a serious football team? Can we really say we a serious ball club with efforts like that? We knew the offense was shorthanded. We'll get to them bum at. We'll get to them in a minute. We knew the offense was shorthanded. We do this already. So we know the defense had to give the offense as many chances possible to go out there and find a footing and make something happen. And what the hell we get? What the hell we get? What the hell we get? It's almost like we love to be embarrassed. Then we love to come out and show people that we could play the game after we was embarrassed. Why do it take for us to be embarrassed to come out here and show people that we could play defense? Clearly, we could play defense. You seen how we played against the Saints? We could play defense. Why the hell? Is, what's the mental block that's stopping us from playing defense like that every week? What's the mental block that's stopping us from playing like that every week? What is it? How we just completely get Maddox Buns. Can't tackle. Nicole Dean, I don't care how much y'all like him. Can't tackle. CJ, that's my dog. CJ not really squaring up trying to tackle. What the fuck is we doing? What is being taught in, in practice that we don't want to go out there and hit and tackle and gang tackle and wrap up? What is it? Everybody want to say, oh, Vic Fangio scheme, Vic Fangio scheme, Vic Fangio scheme. From the scheme that I'm looking at, Nobody's getting burnt toast down the sideline. Nothing's going over our head. It's looking like a bunch of intermediate, intermittent to short throws, and guys are having a clear beat to tackle somebody one-on-one, -on -one and they can't do it. Vic Fangio's scheme calls for guys to be able to tackle guys one-on-one -on -one in space. We don't have the guys that could do that. That's actually hard to do in the NFL, but we look pathetic doing it. Maddox throwing his body around like a fucking crash dummy that flew out of a windshield and, and a crash test, missing completely. Nicole Dean jumping at people's ankles. What are you talking about? Then we really couldn't even stop the run. We really couldn't even stop the run. And this was the kicker. This is why you could say the scheme is shitty. This is the kicker, though. You had Nolan Smith on Chris Godwin and man to man. I should throw, the, I should throw this phone down the street. Nolan Smith on Chris Godwin and man to man. That just don't even make sense. What's the personnel packages? What is going on around here? What's going on around here? What are we trying to accomplish, man? What are we trying to accomplish? 
We look trash. I'm disrespected that I even sat and watched all three hours of that game. Disrespected. Then we knew we was, we, 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 look, we got touched up. They put up 24. You know what I'm saying? Then they only put up what? They, they only put up uh, another nine in the second half. They only put up another nine in the second half. So the defense start making some things happen, I guess. I guess. They start making some things happen. And then here comes Saquon giving us a fighting chance. Jalen got the ball in his hand to cut it to a seven-point lead to make this thing extremely interesting. Extremely interesting. Jalen got the chance to do it. No pocket awareness to fumble. Listen, man, we are losing the turnover battle. We ain't scoring in the first quarter. The whole team as a whole. Now, I know I've been a major component or a major person on the side of saying, listen, the turnovers ain't causing us no games. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not going to worry about it right now. But that level, that, 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 when losing the turnover battle that much, it's not sustainable, man. You can't win, especially if you're not scoring early in the game. We ain't scoring the first quarter at all this year. We have not scored in the first quarter at all this year. Now, listen, A.J. Brown only played one game so far. A.J. Brown only played one game so far. We going into week five. We going into week five. A.J. only played one game so far. You know what I'm saying? So I, I, I get it. You've been missing players. Devontae missed this game. Jalen Hurts went into battle with Britton Covey. Uh, not even Britton Covey. Jalen went in the battle with, 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 come on, who, who? I don't even want to name them dudes, man. Paris Campbell did catch a touchdown pass. You know what I'm saying? Jalen Hurts went in the battle with a very, very mid-wide receiver group. And he moved the ball at times. He moved the ball. He really actually made some okay throws in this game. But the turnover, man, I know it was a strip sack, whatever, but it comes at the wrong times, bro. It's just so opportunistic. Like It's like... Jalen Hurts turnovers come when we in striking distance. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that. We need Jalen Hurts to increase his pocket awareness. We need Jalen Hurts to not throw the ball to the other team. And we need the defense. We need the whole team to tighten up during this bye week, bro. We need the whole team to tighten up during this bye week. Howie Roseman got two weeks to go find an edge rusher. You know what I'm saying? AJ will be healthy. Smitty will be back. You know what I mean? We got, listen, there's no more bye weeks after this. To be two and two with what we had to go through so far in the beginning half of this season is a blessing. It's a blessing. It's a blessing. We're going to count the fact that we two and two and we're going to keep it moving. We're going to keep it moving, man. You know what I mean? But this, this, this is a one, this one is going to leave not even a sour taste in my mouth because I wasn't really, I wasn't really too high on the win, but I'm always going to pick my team to win. But the way the defense look, bro, the defense got a couple more games that are looking like that. You don't change them habits overnight. You don't change them habits overnight. You don't. And we soft like that because, you know what I'm saying, I, I truly believe that we're making a mistake by not playing Devin White. I truly believe we're making a mistake by hitching our wagon so tight to N'Kobe Dean. N'Kobe Dean missed like four tackles in the first fucking quarter, man. Your job is to tackle. Your job is to tackle. Your job is to tackle. And I can't defend Jalen Hurts. I'm going to tell you why I can't defend Jalen Hurts no more. Because he keep giving people the turnover thing to talk about. Bro, if you play a clean game and y'all still lose by the same score, probably three more points on the board because you don't throw that pass. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 dog, I'm, I'm, I'm defending him the whole game against people, bro. Because what are you expecting to do when your defense give Baker Mayfield 150 passing yards in the first quarter? What do you expect Jalen Hurst to do? What do you expect him to do? But as soon as you, as soon as you get some momentum and you turn that ball over like that, I can no longer defend it, bro. I can't defend it. Y'all all ass. Both sides of the ball ass. Especially without Devontae and Smitty. Y'all need to tighten up, bro. Y'all need to tighten up. Y'all need to tighten up, man. Y'all got to understand something, man. I'm not one of them content creators. I don't give a damn about no interview. I don't care about no subscriber count. I don't care about none of them accolades. I care about the team's success. Not a lot of people built like that. Not a lot of people built like that. A lot of people see this as, you know what I mean, that, that, that the video was going to do what the video was going to do because... I'm already who I'm supposed to be on, 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 on the joint. I ain't built like that, bro. I'm going to come on here and I want to talk about wins. How you doing, man? I want to come out here and talk about wins. I don't want to keep talking about losses. I want to talk about wins. Wins. And we, look at, we, we looking bad. We looking bad in the light. We looking funny in the light. 
We looking like a counterfeit 20 right now. The only person that's showing up every week is Saquon Barkley. Saquon Barkley is showing up. Jalen Hurts need to stop turning the ball over and the defense need to go out there and tackle. Play defense. Play defense. I don't like being laughed at. Do y'all like being laughed at? 